Okay, back here we go. The bitter climb. This time, do not get distracted by a random guy dying on the side of the road. <laughs> and let's go. Don't get distracted by a random guy dying on the side of the road. Something's beeping. Was it just you? The way to the mountain will be hard. Ferocious machines prowl every step of the climb. More corrupted? Not corrupted, but they will not tolerate humans. So what else is new? I'm surprised there hasn't been like a rope swing scene yet. Tomb Raider-esque rope swing. We do get slow-mo though. Take that slow mo. The stalkers in the open. Watchers on the other side. Lovely. Just lovely. <sighs> Try to sneak past them all. Try and probably not succeed, but all oh, right. Just set it off. Damn it. Now they're gonna be looking for me, unless there's a tap on the left that's perfectly placed foothold. Yeah, that was so not smooth, but... Who watches the watchers? I feel like I can just take a boot it. You guys still don't see me. I am unseeable. No, I'm just not sure if I'm supposed to go this way. Yeah. <laughs> supposed to be over there on the left. It's all right. We all forge our own paths. Built new roads. I think I saw that one on a Chevy commercial. Built new roads. It's like Skyrim, man. <laughs> Just climbing the mountain like this. There you go. There you go. Beautiful. Didn't have to murder one defenseless robot that's trying to terraform the world. Well, maybe that directive was 
destroyed when Hades came for it. Do they think they're guarding Gaia? I doubt they think at all. More like an instinct, gathering them to her grave. Okay, then we'll go across. Boxes for everyone. I need this. You take what you want, Aloy. Take what you want. Left side, right side, more welts. Freaking Liger. I don't know how that didn't sound. To me. It's okay, it's busy. Run! Just stay out of their way for now. Man, this is a quite the climb, isn't it? Jesus. We're gonna fell a mountain. <laughs> Who's out there? Another one! I just killed one of you! I'm guessing that I'm almost there. I guess we just run for it. We can run for it! Horsey, come to me. You don't need to fight. Oh, shit. I think you lost sight of me. Oh, I was wrong. Always oh, wrong. Is this? That was a vantage point I missed there. <laughs> what are you doing? Sacrifice. I did this? Cracked the inside of the mountain like it was an egg? Yes, yes. Quickly now. I've prepared the way ahead for you. So you've been in here before? To a point, you'll see. Last move. You made a climbing path for me, but left an army of machines for me to deal with? Since when were machines any obstacle for you? If you could fly, I wouldn't have bothered with a climbing path either. I don't understand why we can't hack a Glint talk and just, Don't look down. Don't look you know. down. Uh, Glint talk the bigger version of the Glint talk. <laughs> there we go. Gaia Prime. 
This is exactly the kind of place I expected to find you in, Silence. Thank you. It's one of many workshops I've constructed over the years. Anything of value? Nada. For years, I tried to get through this hatch. I drilled, I burned, I blasted. But we both know that you won't have any trouble getting through. You make it sound like I should apologize. Not at all. It never occurred to me that the way through would not be with force, but with a key. A key in human form. The failure of imagination was mine, not yours. Looks like you've spent a lot of time here. Nineteen years ago, a great explosion destroyed this mountain. Gaia's death, your birth. The echo could be heard as far as the claim. Ash darkened the skies. How they fretted in Meridian as they tried to read this omen. The crater burned for weeks, but when it cooled, I was the first to behold what lay within. Over time, the machines closed ranks to protect it. Useful. Soon, no one dared to come here. Except me. In her message, Gaia said we could restore her, but... After seeing the damage, how could that be? She said any effort to repair her must come after Hades is destroyed. I concur. Rebuilding the terraforming system now might allow Hades to use it as a weapon. And because of Gaia's sacrifice, it has been forced to search for means that are less... convenient. But... do you think it's even possible to restore Gaia? Well, you know what the cauldrons are capable of. How they fabricate any technology necessary to create a machine. And by the same principle, it should be possible to replicate every technology necessary to repair Gaia. But that would take years, and we're counting the time we have left by the hour. I thought you might actually be here this time. Actually, here. Why? My presence is unnecessary. You don't need my help to pass through this door. You were the one born to do this, not me. It's time for me to head in. Yes. When you find the Master Override, you will gain the power to defeat Hades. Everything depends on you. <laughs> no pressure, man. No pressure. Genetic identity confirmed. Entry authorized. Greetings, Dr. Sobek. You are clear to proceed. Greetings. So much beeping. We gotta get over there. second is this what I've been looking for is it here yeah this should be the last power cell I need to get to that ancient armor I found beautiful should I just fast travel and get out of here <laughs> so I can get the ancient armor the last power cell Damn, man. Guess that's my way across. Can't wait to get my new armor. It's gotta be legit. <sighs> Glad that's over. Oh, it ain't over, baby. It is not over. The fat lady has not yet sung so, not this way maybe further up the shaft we're looking for a master override switch of some sort heal me
we're supposed to go up. Not down. This must have been where they lived. What's left of it? Once this was all enclosed by rock and metal. Record. I just woke up. It's. I see the numbers, but can't make up the time. I was dreaming of. Uh, I was giving a lecture in Q Hall. Maybe it was something more <clears throat> shamanistic. I, I don't know. An audience of shadowy faces under a blank open sky. I told them the world ended with a bang. A plague of robots. But the last humans. We went out, not with a whimper, but a whisper. You know, in caves, ending like we started, huddled around a flickering glow. The heads of state, the Fortune Fives, the leaders, and lottery winners, and life cults, all of them buried in their little shelters. Some believing they'll live it out. Evacuation happens so fast. No time to think things through. No time for goodbyes. There were lines in the medical ward. I told Tom Pake I'd be with him when he went under. But there was one last shipment of parody Saidi zygotes I could get processed if I rushed. I'm still angry at him for forcing me to choose. Angry at myself for- Elizabeth's room. I know it. She didn't even get a chance to unpack. These are her journals. Elizabeth's journals. And they're all destroyed? Scan them. The focus can rebuild them, but the process is slow. To us, it seems a powerful device, but its engine is tiny and limited. How slow? Days, weeks, years. Concern yourself with stopping Hades and extending the future, and you might live long enough to hear them. Crouch, please. There you go. Elizabeth. What is this? It's a shrine? This is Charles Ronson. I'm logging this six hours after final deployment of Gaia Prime. This morning, an access port seal malfunctioned. Gaia Prime's port seals were designed to close with a seam of less than two millimeters. But this one closed with a 10 millimeter gap. Enough for an energy signature to bleed through. Enough for the swarm to detect this facility. Enough for Gaia to be discovered and destroyed. Enough to end the future we worked so hard to make possible. Unless the hatch servos were manually re-engaged from the outside. I'm now switching to a recording of the event. Well, I'm not going out there. Now who I signed up for? Either we send someone out or all of this was for nothing. It should be Liz's decision. So when is she going to get here? She said five minutes. You don't think? Oh no. Okay, everyone. I've repaired the seal. Gaia? Seal closure at 1.4 millimeters. Confirmed. Elizabeth, no. We'll find a way to bring you back in. It's not gonna happen. The swarm's too close. Really. It's all right. Gaia's complete. She'll take care of things from here on out. That's what she does. Not like this. There's so much we- Guys, you know me. I'm- I'm no good at endings, at letting things end, so, um, let's not. So, happy trails, Liz, and uh, see you around. Yeah. Take care of each other, all right? Liz. I'm okay with this. I want to go home. Goodbye. 
hero a hero in both lives. Where's the body? That was the last transmission of Elizabeth Sobek. She gave everything for the hope of life on this planet. And we are all in her debt. Hell, Liz. I know. I know you're never gonna hear this. That's not the point. You, uh... <laughs> you got to play the savior in the motor all at once this time. Great work. you a eulogy. I had to try to express <laughs> all your children. After all Apollo has taught them, they'll think they know everything, but they have to understand what you did for them. How you loved the whole world so much with an intensity that was dazzling. Bruising. And in the end, it killed you, or you died for it. Different perspectives. No one could keep up with you, live up to you. I, I don't know, maybe if, if, I, if I hadn't taken that postdoc in Joburg. I'm glad you shot down the Lightkeeper protocol in the end. I don't think I could have taken seeing another one of you. I mean, Elizabeth Sobek. There's only one. I miss you. <sighs> Look, Liz. You are pretty. So, I'm Lighthouse Protocol. Interesting. But if it was shut down, then who who reactivated it? Aloy. She's gone. Really gone. You knew she couldn't have survived, Aloy, and her achievements were beyond exceptional while her people bickered she was the one who took responsibility the only one who could she was better than them that's not what i said she was you shouldn't be afraid to admit it can't you just for one moment stop calculating and let yourself feel she sacrificed herself for her friends, for the future, for life on Earth. Doesn't that stir anything in you? The generosity of it. You're trying to invest her decision with something magical. It was a rational choice, not based on sentimentality. You're wrong. Remember, she knew it wasn't enough for Gaia to think. She taught Gaia to feel. To care, to sacrifice, to believe in life. Enough to fight against hopelessness. If it wasn't for that sentimentality, life would have ended. You and I would never have existed. Your argument is sound. I'm sorry for your... loss. She said she wanted to go home. Maybe. What? Nothing. It's time to go on. Where did you go? Where the hell is this master override? Why are we gonna plug into their heads, Les? A whole lot of history? A whole lot of so-called truth? A whole, a whole lot of noise? It's not tablet letters. It's poison. You think Ted Farrell at the end of this screwed us all? The guy who brought the machine apocalypse down on us? Who activated Skynet? Did he fuck us in the ass in the end? There's another section at the back of the crater. Looks like it survived the blast. Because it was armored, you found the control room. I'm on my way. <laughs>
We're on the other side now. Maybe that last comment was a little bit too strong. It was a bit aggressive, I must admit. A bit aggressive. I've, I've been taking a hard look at the project. In the end, it's simple. It's clean. It's clear. Erasure. Addition by subtraction. I can make a better list. With a single stroke, make it all go away. I really don't like the direction this is going. Continue. This bastard, he created Hades, didn't he? You jackass. There was a door there. No. What happened? When I opened the hatch, the air rushed in from this side. Because there was none inside the chamber. But the alphas were in there. That was a very astute observation about the air. I definitely would not have noticed that. I'm telling ya. Pharaoh went crazy in the end of all of it. I'm locked out of court control. Alpha clearance overridden. What the hell is Omega clearance? Oh no. Alpha personnel. Sorry to alarm you, but I need you to listen, okay? To what I'm about to say. This isn't easy. See, uh, I've, um, uh, please, stop trying to access the system, okay? See, see, what this is about is, um, I said stop trying to access the goddamn system. And wh what I'm trying to say is I can't stop thinking about the ones who come after us. Those innocents, those blameless men and, 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 and women. We're gonna give them knowledge? Like it's a gift? Ted, Ted. We've talked about this before. Apollo has 3,000 plus failsafe conditions. It's not a gift, it's a disease. They're the cure, and we're gonna give them the disease. Our disease? No. We can't. And it's not too late. If we're willing to sacrifice. Ted, it doesn't need to be like this. It already is, Samina. I did it three minutes ago. I've purged Apollo. It's gone. All of it. Every copy. A sacrifice? It's not a sacrifice. It's cultural obliteration, you crazy bastard. Millennia of culture. I'm sorry. Really, I am. But sometimes, to protect innocence, innocents have to die. Emergency alert. Venting atmosphere. This motherfucker, I knew it! Fucking knew it! He. He killed them all. So this is why. This is why we were trapped in benighted ignorance for an innocent future. Blameless men. <sighs> he never saw the slaughter in the sun ring. Everything these people achieved. All the knowledge of the old ones evaporated, turned to dust, scattered to the void, like the alphas themselves. No, not a void. When the hatch unsealed and scattered their ashes on the wind, it took them out among the world they made, the world we are living in. It's, it's a monument. 
to what they died trying to accomplish. A monument to oblivion. Not oblivion, silence. Hope. Master override. You're mine. The master override. That's so small. Now all you have to do is kill Hades with it. 